Now folks, I'm sitting in a totally different place today because I'd started doing different lanes and there's end up being too much hill. <laughs> so I thought sod it, I'm coming back down. <laughs> sit by the river and watching the little fishies. Uh, it's got shaded over at the moment. Sit there watching the fishies, listen to the birdies sing. I'm wondering now uh, how is everyone doing under this lockdown? What are you doing for boredom? <laughs> it comes night time I'm like <sighs> afternoon I'm gagging. I'm dying to get out camping. Uh, I might do camp in my garden like everyone else. I can test my new tent and my sleeping bag because it was any good. Uh, it's so hard because I know for a fact I, I go in there. As soon as I want to go to I wake up to go to the toilet in the night. Because I do a few times. I probably just if I have to go in my house and go upstairs I just jump in my bed and I'm about a twelve inch mattress and it's just so soft. <laughs> Why should I punish my body lying in the tent? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's not the same, is it? If you're doing something, activities, you're camping, you're tying yourself out, but sitting in the garden. <laughs> so we'll see. And, uh, decluttering my house, got loads of junk in the garden, furniture bagged up and got piles. I can't even get a skip at the moment, so I'm lumbered with all that junk. <laughs> so anyway, let me know what you're all doing. I feel sorry for you city folks and towns where you've got no countryside round you. See, I'm blessed. This is on my doorstep. Uh, too many, well, yeah, no. 30 second ride, I'm out on this path to lead me into the woods. And off I go on these tracks, but not many people walk. Uh, sometimes you have to meet across the busier tracks, but yeah. So I was going to go down the usual place in the river, but because I went round a different way, I did climb up to the top. But oh, I decided I just want to come down here and sit here. Oh, it's quiet. As you see, nobody around really. Park shop. They have a little uh, way in water thing down there on the river. I've done photos in the past. daughter and a boyfriend at home. Uh, I'm ready for him to go back. <laughs> I can never to go back to just seeing each other. <laughs> anyway, my life struggles. <laughs> but I am so blessed. My legs have bit, been, been a bit dodgy lately, my hips, so I'm not it's hoping to do more. So considering I'm not doing a lot, like everyone else. <laughs> All these people walking around this river are giving me a wide berth. <laughs> so I love to get out, privacy. There's lots of passes by here. Let's see, it's a public footpath. If I walk down there and I go at the end, there's a mini railway beyond that fence. If I go right at the end, that's where I sit on another water river point. But uh, last time I went around there, there was lots of glass. So I don't really want to take my bike scrambling on that. I took a, we've got a friend's dog. Uh, looking after him for a bit. I don't know if I did a little video, showed him. It's an English bull, Staffy Cross. Oh, he's a beaut. He is so well behaved. I've been to Sea Shadow today. Uh, I gave him an, an Easter rabbit toy. <laughs> Teddy bear. Uh, yeah, he's not doing very well. He's getting older. He can't. He's hurt his leg at some point and keeps re-hurting it. Uh, he's trying to train him now to not to jump on high things like a bed. <laughs> she's brought him a single mattress. Not a dog bed, a single mattress. 
That's Shadow, Sport Rotten. Uh, anyway, I said, well, you, she's working from my home at the moment, but I miss him. And I don't want to go in her house. I've just told her, you have to drop him off for an hour, just come and sit with me for an hour. <laughs> He was so excited to see me. I don't see him so much because she's moved out away from my mother's house, so I don't really go there with this isolation. I've not had the chance to even sit, go in and see the house. She's just brought it just, just, just in time before all this madness happened. So, anyway, update Charlie. Oh, wow, well, he's getting an old boy now. Uh, he's still limping. He's doing just tiny little walks out with his owner. He's not much of a big walker, and that's what walker. That's why I used to take him. She likes the little walks, but that's what he used to enjoy coming out for little big walks in between. But now none of them are capable of doing it at the moment. Well, Charlie will never be, and I don't think she'll ever push Shadow anymore. About eight now, eight, seven, eight. Time flies. He was about two years, two and a half years when I started taking him out. Here we go. Here's my phone. <laughs> That's always somebody has to text or message or. Anyway, here's my bike. I know I need a camera, but to, for the price of a one, what's really going to work for me? It's a bit too pricey for me. I need the subscribers. <laughs> About the subscribers, I will never be able to up my game. Unless <laughs> I win the lottery. Uh, yeah, I've got a lot of better gear than I did in the beginning, but you know, it's better gear than there's the top gear. My down bag's about at it. I don't think it keeps me warm as it should do anymore, so... If I winter camp, I'd take that and my new, new bag. Just, just double it, because it's bigger than my new bag anyway, so... There you go. Got corners. People walking so close to me. <laughs> right, anyway, let me know how you're doing. And what you're doing to kill this time, and... If you've got kids, how are you keeping them occupied? That'd be interesting to know. Take care. Stay safe wherever you are in the world. Bye bye.